All right, welcome to day three of the week of We Dig It. Uh, today we're going to talk about some of our favorite finds uh, and some other stuff that we've got setting out here for you. So let's get to the video. to start off with this is something we started when did we start this guys about march yeah about march and it is just a jar two jars totally full of pull tabs um you know we thought we'd see how many we could dig up in about you know a few months and we really haven't added everything to it every time but you know as we think about it this is one of our favorite things about this hobby this is our mail if you've ever sent us a, a gift or a piece of mail it is here now the stickers are on the board and then we've got the uh extra stickers that we have in a bin but these are our uh, this is our mail all the letters we've received and this is our sticker board as you can see it is full so we actually have another board over there behind Gene that we're going to be getting ready uh, and putting all the stickers on from here on. You wanna tell them about this? Yeah, so this is our clad and it's a lot. So we've got dimes, uh, pennies, nickels, all of it, it's falling down. And this is only for 2021. This is only this year. And we're gonna fill up this far. We were trying to get to $300 in a year. And how far are we so far? This is $248 in coins. So $50 in about two months. Can we do it, guys? I think we can do it. I think we can do it. 50 yeah. bucks in two months. And then, Cole, Cole, what's this? This is our chaining. I don't know how long, but that's There's actually a, a very small portion of it. That's just part of our chaining. But have, if we find any pottery, yeah. we usually put it in containers. And as yeah. you can see, all the different colored pieces and all that. We have a gallon container that's like used to be an ice cream container, filled to the brim of chaining. And a whole nother jar, so much of this back there, full of it. Very cool. All right, on to our favorite finds. I think this one we'll do first. This is Levi. He's going to tell us about it. This is our first silver coin. It's a Danish West Indian uh, five cent piece. And there will be links in the video to all of these videos. Next, um, this right here was actually the very first gold ring I ever found. I found this one first uh, and this one on the same day. And so this is actual diamonds. Both are 14 karat gold. Uh, so that was a really interesting day. I was all by myself. I don't go metal detecting by myself very often, but that day I did and I'm very glad that I did. All right, Cole, you want to tell them about your ring here? Sure. I found a ring. It's a Crusian knot. It's pure silver. It's my first ring I've ever found. And it's $50 online if you want to buy it. And uh, Not that ring specifically, but just yeah. <laughs> at the jeweler if you yeah. want to buy one like it. I'm not giving that away. Uh, this is a silver man. He's pure silver. And uh, it has something to do with Tiwanaku. So we don't really know. Handmade. Yeah, we don't really know much about it other than it's handmade and it's very old and it's silver. All right, Gene. All right, so I've got three things here. Let's start off with my favorite. This is my favorite find that we've ever found. It is a coin. Some of you might describe it as pirate treasure. It is uh, a Maravedi, two Maravedi, and it was minted in Santo Domingo from 1506 to 1516. They did not put the date on it then. All the words are in Latin, and we had no idea what it was, and it's paper thin. So we found it, and we didn't know, and we took it home, and we did a few days of research before we figured out what it is. It is the first coin minted in the New World in Santo Domingo. It's a Spanish coin. Very cool. Crazy find. Right here is the first ring we dig it ever dug up. The gold ring. First gold ring we dig it ever dug up. It says love, as you can see right there. It's like 14 karat gold, and it is beautiful. It is, I dug it up uh, at a basketball court, 
And yeah, that is one of my favorites too. And this is the most recent find, I think, on the whole table. One of them. And it is gold. It's 14 karat gold, and it is 7 grams. It opens up. It's a locket. We're thinking sometime in the mid-1900s, because where we're at used to be a horse farm. As you can see, it's in the shape of a horseshoe. The little hinge is broken, but it still clips just fine, stays together. Very shiny, super cool, seven grams, 14 karat gold. And that's one of my favorites, just because it's so much gold and it's old and very, very cool. And then I think my favorite find that I have found is this. This is our little silver cross. It's a pendant, would have hung on a necklace like this. And right there it says uh, Atocha and then 925. And this is actually a piece that we found at a beach and it was just covered in coral. Uh, had to tumble it for hours. And when we found this piece, it actually made it onto the weekly dirt, which is pretty cool. We'll put a link to that video also. Um, but it, it is silver from the 1622 shipwreck of the Atocha. So it's pretty cool. Uh, we'll show you a picture of all of our jewelry that is silver and gold right now. And we'll also put in um, other pictures, you know, as we're wrapping this up. We've been metal detecting for under less than two years. Um, we really enjoy this hobby. Uh, it has helped all of us get closer together. You're not seeing Seth in this video, and that's because he is recording this video for us. Um, so, hope you guys enjoy this week. Tomorrow, Thursday, will be live at the beach. We have found a new beach where we're finding old coins. And so we're gonna go there and dig live. Uh, and it'll be, you know, I'll be recording and Gene will be digging and then we'll let him record and I'll dig a little bit and see what we can find tomorrow. So thank you guys for coming along. Have a great day. All right, I've redone a little song here. Let's go. It's a big silver man and a gold ring with diamonds. That gold pendant that looks like a horseshoe A silver ring and anything that shines These are a few of our favorite finds That silver pendant that's made from a shipwreck This copper coin that's as old as Columbus A first silver coin and any gold that shines These are a few of our favorite finds when the knox beeps, when the simplex squeaks, when it's early morn, I simply remember my favorite finds, and then I don't feel so bored. <laughs>